Good evening. It is shit. I think it's Wednesday, December 9th, twenty twenty. Oh, I'm all jacked up. Got an added shift this week, and it's got my schedule in my head all cocked. I'll know when it's Saturday because I won't go to work the next night. Anyway, hope everyone's doing well. I'll save that for another day. Turn this off, though. So I'm sure by now most people have seen Michigan Representative Cynthia A. Johnson's three-minute Facebook rant about making Trumpers pay. If you're a soldier, you know what to do. Do it cleanly. Do it clean. I can't remember her exact words. I find it funny, and not funny, haha, -ha, that last night, last night, I believe so, I was talking about Claire, Michigan resident's house being firebombed because he was a known Republican and a Trump supporter. And within a day or two of that happening, this lady goes on Facebook and speaks for three minutes about how Trumpers and Republicans need to be made to pay. Now, forget the fact that she was allowed to post that. Because, well, let's face it, that's inciting violence. But it was obviously up there long enough to make the rounds. One, to get to the guy who sent it to me. Two, for Dabu77 to put up a video about it. three, it wasn't yanked, she wasn't pressured to yank the video, as far as I know it's still there, somebody will correct me in the comments, that's why I love you guys, you have no problem telling me when I uh, botch something, had that been somebody of a different political leaning and probably of a different color, no. yeah, I'll, I'll leave it. I'll leave that statement stand. That would have been yanked down. That person would have been thrown in Facebook jail, if not booted off. And they might even have gotten a visit from the feds for inciting violence and domestic terrorism. say make them pay and if you're a soldier do it clean or do it cleanly I forget the wording the, whether she said clean or cleanly either way if you served in the military you know what that means and I'm guessing even if you didn't serve in the military you can guess what that means So these people feel empowered enough that there will be no consequence for their action to say this stuff publicly in an open forum to their supporters someone acts, enacts violence on people like you and I, what would that lady say? 
they must have misunderstood my message. Or, <laughs> they probably had it coming. Well, Representative Cynthia Lee, look into my eye. Bring it. I got a receipt for you. Because not everybody is scared of your bullshit. Not everyone is intimidated by your thugs. that would be on the receiving end of being made to pay or being taken care of cleanly. If your political iterations are known, if your candidate support is of no question to those around you. But the morality and decency of the people around you is in question. I suggest you up your defensive posture. aware of your surroundings anytime you go anywhere. on their tactical voice when they talk to you from five miles down the end of a dirt road. So it might do you some good to know if that IT geek next door has an Antifa flag in their basement or maybe just thinks Trumpers and Republicans need to pay. Maybe they need to find out what happens when you invade someone's home with 
the intent of doing the occupant harm. Might cause them to rethink their current situation in life real quick. Last night I spoke about how much time we had left until the poop hit the oscillating device, right? And I said, well, depending on where you are, it already did. And if you're not in one of those places, you're on borrowed time. Maybe you ought to start acting like you're not on borrowed time. And the shit already did hit the fan. It's just a matter of when the fan sprays in your direction. You know, I don't live five miles down a dirt road in the middle of nowhere. And I'm not going to talk to you like tactical voice. What I can tell you is I have the means to treat injury in my home while waiting for an ambulance. I have the means to defend my home if some undesirable should decide my front door is worthy of their foot. fails. A fire bomb comes through your front window, you better have a plan for getting out your back window and dealing with the possibility that whoever threw it, threw it through the front window with the intent of you coming out the back. Are. 
you think this is just going to go away, work itself out on its own, you're sorely mistaken. Sorely mistaken. <clears throat> that difference and continue to be who you are. So you should probably get it into your head that there's a whole lot of people out there that would like to figure out how to make you pay. Catch you guys in the next one. Be curious to see the comments below. Give me a like, share, subscribe if you want. I'd prefer you stuck around instead of lurking. It's creepy. Um, I'll catch you in the next one. Be safe. Watch your six. Out for now. <laughs>